Lou and Lowell's Travels here and today we've come back to Dovedale. Yeah, when we went, uh, I think it was about a month ago, it was really busy but we went on a Saturday uh, so we're here on a weekday now. So we're just going to go and have a look at the, the bits that we didn't see before, hopefully see the caves and hopefully this time get over the stepping stones. Just a generic points of interest really that we're going to try and point out to you. Yeah, so let's go and have a look. Right, so Dovedale is a national nature reserve with internationally important ancient ash woodland, wildflower rich grassland and a river full of wildlife. Thousands of people visit each year to enjoy this special part of the Peak District. Right, so we've decided today to approach the stepping stones from this lane. Previously we were on the other side of the water but we noticed that the movement of traffic came from this direction so let's see. result of the uh, going over the steps we've had to walk back down to the bridge and come back on the opposite side of the water yeah well, that's all right though we have done this side before as you see, um, we have done a little dovedale video before so this is the side that we went on originally but yeah. it doesn't matter because we're still gonna look yeah. at the things that we didn't see originally but on the positive going on that side initially allowed us to film the area from a different perspective yeah, it did. All these sort of like big hills, they're lovely. Yeah, so let's head on. for the points of interest we're using this book on this page and as you can see there it numbers what everything is so we're going to be referencing this book today right so at the minute I'm stood right on top of Lover's Leap stone coming out of the rock face of the 12 disciples so this magnificent rock face it's known as the Tissington Spires. Right, so we've made it to our next point of interest, which is Dovedale Church. Right, so we have Reynard's Cave. I don't think I, I better go into it because the, it's just rain and the stones that you have to climb up are all quite wet so I don't think I'm going to push my luck right now but yeah it's a beautiful place Right, 
Right, so that scramble up to Reynolds Cay was absolutely epic. It was quite scary, got the adrenaline going and oh, and then that massive downpour when I was stuck in the middle. Yeah, because it just downpoured, we yeah, rained into it all of a sudden. it is absolutely soaking. I'm, How do you feel you, though? Well, you feel alive, don't you? Um, mm. I couldn't go in the cave because of the... I just didn't think I'd risk it anymore, especially with the rain. But it took me quite a bit to get down, but well, that definitely is. It makes you feel alive and. Wow! <laughs> that's what you're after, that yeah. sort of feeling. So, visit Reynolds Cave, but just be very, very careful. Yeah, especially when it all of a sudden rains. <laughs> yeah, and you're stuck in the eye of the storm with a camera up your top. <laughs> but yeah, so. Whew, let's head on to gentler pastures. Right, on the left over here, we have Illum Rock and then directly opposite, we have Pickering Tor. Right, and here we have the impressive Dove Holes. So today what we've done, we've parked here at Dovedale Car Park, we've come down here to the stepping stones and we've wandered all the way up the River Dove to number 10 which was Dove Holes. So the reason being that we've not completed the full walk is because we got out late today due to heavy rain but this has, this has exceeded our expectations immensely. Right, so that brings us to the end of our expedition. All I'm saying is wow. Dovedale wow. has got <laughs> so many elements to it. I mean, I just thought that it was, you know, the stepping stones and the main bit and, and that. But if you carry on, honestly, it's definitely worth it. There's, there's so many treats. You've got the caves behind us, mm. uh, all the lovely rockery and yeah. the stream. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, we've, we've done all the um, points of interest from the book that we wanted to do. There's only one more to go, but um, we need to think about heading back now, don't we? Yeah, we're going to head back to the, the car now. And uh, yeah, so we've just got to, to walk back the same way we came. But, but yeah, d we definitely, definitely recommend this. Come a bit further than the steps. Come and see the dove holes for yourself and everything in between. You won't be disappointed. You won't. The only thing I would say is if you do come to Dovedale, it's a lot better to come on a weekday as well. Oh, nobody's here. So, yeah, yeah, we've only seen... Not not a lot of people. No, not like the other time. Yeah. So, yeah, we hope you've enjoyed this uh, Week in the Peaks instalment. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. See you then. Bye.